This is N7RXE, and the purpose of this video is to test out upgrading firmware on a mesh node that you don't have direct access to. So let's look at the network that I have. I've got uh, my node that I'm plugged into. So I have internet off, I don't have access to the internet. I am plugged via an ethernet cord into a mesh node N7RXE-2 and that is plugged into the LAN, the LAN port. Okay, and that's how I'm accessing this, through local node 8080. Okay, I want to upgrade the firmware on N7RXE-1. We're going to pretend that I need to upgrade that firmware. Okay, so I'm going to click on N7RXE-1. I'm going to click on Setup. Okay, now it's password protected, but I'd already been in, so it's recognized me. Otherwise, I'd enter, be entering my password there. All right, first thing I want to do is click on Administration. And you'll notice I have an option to choose the file. Okay, I went to the, um, before the video, I went to the, to the High Speed Multimedia Dash Mesh website, and I downloaded the file that I need. And the file that I needed, and I did not realize this, um, I'm going to do one with it's a .trx. Okay, I don't need a binary because I've already got Mesh software installed. This is a patch to bring it up to 0 0.4, 0 0.3, and it's a .trx. Okay, so if I'm just upgrading a node, I don't need the full binary. All right, so then I'm going to click Open, and I'm going to click Upload. Okay, so um, I've connected to the N7RXE-1, uh, basically remotely, and I'm going to hopefully upload that this software to it and to that node. It says it's uploading, it's at 60, 70%, 70, 80% now, hitting 90. Let's see what happens. Um, this is new to me, never done this before. Okay, and I have done that. It is spinning, so I can't do anything. Let's see what happens. I am very curious. So it's telling me that website has been uh, unresponsive. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go back to local node 8080. And let's go to Mesh Stash. Let's just see what's going on. My guess is it's rebooting. Oh, it shows it there. Okay. I'm going to click on it. And it says it's there. And it says this node is not yet configured. Okay. So I'm going to choose Setup. The SSID is okay. It's natting. I don't want it to be a mesh gateway. It's got my node name. Um, you know, all appearances to me is that it worked and that it is working. Okay, that allowed it to work. I was able to update the software um, remotely. That's all.